So TMZ puts out a report saying that Hot 97 says that they will no longer play Takashi 6 ix music because Takashi 6 9 is basically a snitch. So TMZ put out a report saying that they are not, Hot 97 that is, going to play Takashi 6 ix music because Takashi 6 9 put gang members in jail. Me and the Notification Gang would like to invite everybody to come join us Monday through Thursday, 9.20 to 10 o'clock for Morning Coffee, where we discuss the events of the prior day and also just talk mess about stuff. See you then. BBN. Jack Frost. What's up, party people? I so yeah. So <laughs> oh man. So apparently <laughs> this story is a, it's funny to me for a couple of different reasons I might mention. One but this is kind of humorous. Anyway, so uh, apparently what has happened is uh, Hot 97 has called... Okay, first, TMZ puts out a report saying that Hot 97 is now... Ha they have like a new, um, I guess, parameters or I don't know. But, you know basically, basically, they was going to not play Takashi's music. Now, I don't know if this stands to Takashi's new music or Takashi's old music but there was a report that tmz put out where tmz said that they were not going to play any of takashi's new what well, music unless oh yeah tmz said that about the hot 97 just so we can be clear unless there is uh i think there's like a uh big following like people start hitting hot 97 up like yo what's up with takashi i guess like that was the only way <laughs> I guess that was like the only way that there was that um, TMZ was saying that they were going to play the music. Well, T um, Hot 97 has decided that they're going to say, nope, fake news. Hashtag false news, actually, is what Hot 97 decided to put out. It was actually on their IG feed. For everybody that doesn't follow Hot 97 on their IG feed, follow them. Also, what the hell? Follow TMZ too. I don't have a problem with neither one of these guys. Follow everybody. Matter of fact, next time you open up your feed, you just start seeing people that you are not following, being talking, follow them. How about that? Anyway, so what ends up happening is, is TMZ is being called out once again for having bad information and sending everybody in the wrong direction. Now, real quick, just so we could be clear. Previously, Hot 97 has already, like, basically uh, spoke on how they really don't care to play Takashi's music that often. And I believe it was Ebro who had said this, that, you know, um, Takashi is an uh, artist that he, you know, really cares to play music. And rightfully so, because if you have your own program, you can put on whatever music you want to put on. And on top of that, Hot 97 has the right to play whatever music they choose to play on their platform. If they don't choose to play music on their platform, they also have that right to not play that music. So just so we clear, no uh, uh, radio station is doing any artist wrong if they decide that the music that they make is not something that they want to put on their platform. They have that right, just so we can be clear. So basically, Hot 97 is saying that TMZ is wrong and TMZ is putting out false information. And I'm going to tell you what I think happened. What I think happened is this. Due to the fact that Hot 97 Ebro specifically has had such a bad relationship, as some might say, with Takashi, being as Takashi had an interview over there that didn't go as planned, probably. I mean, I don't know what the plan was, but I would assume that that wasn't it. And being that Takashi also, in addition to that, has dropped some bars at Ebro, which Ebro and Rosenberg then made fun of because, <laughs> oh, they make fun of everybody that say stuff about them. Then who else said something about them besides, besides Takashi? I forgot who it was. Was it Kodak Black or, I think it could have been Kodak Black or um maybe the Migos or some shit. I don't know. Anyway, so, point being, um, Ebro had 
had some balls thrown at him by Takashi. So if somebody was going to just jump out on a limb, they could surmise that there's a chance that Hot 97 might not want to play Takashi's music. Or if they really want to be coy, they could just elude to the fact that the only way that Hot 97 is going to play Takashi's music is if they were a public outcry. So TMZ saying this is not absolutely out of the water. But this is what I think happened. I think TMZ spoke with somebody that works at Hot 97. I think they told them what the the actual fact was. That, you know, Hot 97 isn't really looking forward to Takashi making new music. It's not important to them. No, we don't even know if we're going to play it. And it wasn't an actual statement that was probably meant for public consumption. And what the individual at TMZ did was decide to run it. Because remember, TMZ, Harvey's a lawyer. They're not just throwing fake stories out that has absolutely no substance. So nobody's suing them. <laughs> so, you know, TMZ, I don't, I don't really hear about TMZ getting sued that often. So, yeah, there's that. But um, even more importantly, just so we can be clear on this, what... TMZ actually did was show that just because Hot 97 had to talk about this, think about this for a minute, radio station refuses to play music of a rap artist that snitches on gang. Think about that for a minute. Now, TMZ told you the way that they wanted to deliver it. Oh, they don't want to play Takashi because Takashi goes and snitches on the gang. That's one way to look at it, right? But think about it. Think about the type of public outrage that Hot 97 would get if they publicly said, "Oh, we're not playing we're not playing any music of any artists that put gang members in jail." We're not playing none of the uh, none of those. Just think about listen to what I'm saying. We're not playing no music of any artists that help the police. Now, with all that being said, I think that Takashi got on the stand and he spoke and he did what he did on the stand. But I also think that there was other things that put these guys in jail. I think that, if anything, Takashi was just an add-on. I don't think that he was the, 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 the culmination of whatever the, uh, the, um, the uh, you know, the, the problems that caused for these individuals to be, you know, currently incarcerated. But what I'm also saying is is that you can't be a platform that say that you're for the people. You can't be a platform that gets mad at Takashi for being with gangs and then also get mad at Takashi for then taking the stand against gangs. There's this thing called hypocrisy. That would be it. That would be one of the most hypocritical things that a radio station can do. Remember, they got all over Takashi for actually being surrounded by a gang. Remember, Ebro tried to, you know, it, 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 in, in the words of, you know, the way that Ebro and Hot 97 see it, Ebro tried to, you know, speak with Takashi and say, yo, look, Takashi, you, you're involved with a gang. This isn't the way to go. Maybe you need to do some other things. You're going down a bad path. No, there's there's only jail or death for you. There's the only negative things could happen to you for you being involved with these particular individuals. And then when Takashi decides that he's going to help the government for whatever his reasonings were, I particularly think he helped the government because, you know, he didn't want to do a whole lot of years in prison. That's why, just to be honest with you, it is what it is. And when Takashi goes and decides he's going to help the government, then Ebro and Hot 97 says, oh, no, we're not going to put in your music because you helped the government. Even though we were busy over here acting all high and mighty. <laughs> you, you understand what I'm saying? So that whole, that whole, as soon as I seen that, I didn't think that made any damn sense. The Hot 97 isn't going to play his music because he snitched. So Hot 97 want the gang's want the drug dealers want the attempted murderers to be out and free is that what you're telling me is that what tmz is telling us because in order for tmz's report on this particular subject to be 100 percent correct they would have to be saying hot 97 is upset because gang members are currently incarcerated due to takashi's testimony 
like, comment, subscribe. Join the notification game. Hashtag Bronx Bombers. Let's get it. I love y'all. Take care of each other. Hug the kids for me. I haven't forgotten about you. And that's all I got on this one. I'm out. If you like this video, please hit the like and subscribe button. If you would like to help dictate the direction that this channel takes, please leave a comment. All comments are appreciated, whether positive or negative. Thank you very much and enjoy your day. And remember, positive thoughts cause for positive things to happen. Let's get it.